For the first time since police shot a man during a scuffle, Austin Police Chief Art Acevedo is speaking to the community. Larry Jackson Jr. was killed last month after running away from a detective investigating a bank robbery. Tonight, people express frustrations at a meeting in East Austin, and that's where our Ma Robert Maxwell is live. Robert, it got loud. It was very loud. A couple of speakers really uh, took to uh, the rafters shouting for a number of minutes saying that they were so frustrated and outraged with the uh, latest police shooting and a police chief on the other hand taking to the stage trying to explain to everybody that they too in APD have the same questions as everybody else in Larry Jackson's shooting. Now the auditorium here at the Carver Museum and Cultural Center was packed with 200 people including the parents of Larry Jackson Jr. Tonight the words are still raw for many here. It's not summertime until one of our black males or Hispanic males is gunned down like a dog. The dogs in Austin get more respect than our young black males. If I could do this investigation in five days, I'd do it in five days. But there's just no way to get everything that we have to do to make it a quality comprehensive investigation in five days. And believe me, I, the reason I said 45 days is because I know there's anger. I know there's questions. And all I ask you is please let the process take its place. And before the evening began, uh, the chief went over to the parents of Larry Jackson Jr., exchanged some quiet words, perhaps expressed his condolences. He said publicly during the meeting that, yes, he did, in fact, apologize to them. The first chance he had to do that, he said. Uh, and this was supposed to be an evening of solutions and listening. And one solution that one speaker suggested was something very simple. It's a catch-all phrase of community unity. What he meant by that, he says, was simply neighbors making the streets safe themselves so the police never have to be called to certain streets. We're live in East Austin, Robert Maxwell, KXAN News. Robert, you mentioned community unity, where there's a big push for community policing in Austin, where officers work and foster relationships in one part of town. But we found APD is struggling to make community policing a priority because of the numbers. An independent study from 2012 shows Austin police officers only have time to talk to people in their assigned communities 15% of the time. Now, community policing models say officers should spend at least 25% of their time in their assigned areas. We told you last Friday part of the reason is APD is moving officers downtown to keep that area in safe. But Austin's police chief also says they need more officers. He asked for 92 more officers in the coming budget year, but right now the proposed budget only includes 47 new officers.